Hello and thank you for watching. The idea for this video was sent in by a viewer, Strawberry Sweet. Can do the pizza, pineapple, pineapple, and ham from Fron Hammer Barn. Thanks, Strawberry Sweet. I think I know what you mean. Sure thing. Funnily enough, my neighbor actually does have a pizza oven as well. Check it out! New pizza oven! So I can relate to Bandit, and my gutter is not in the best shape. <laughs> Before we get into making the pizza, let's head to Hammer Barn. We're going to Hammer Barn. So I went to the local Hammer Barn. All 300 left at the fake bar. Walked up to all 300. You hit a flamingo, you've gone too far. I hit a flamingo, so I'd gone too far. Then I found the pizza ovens, but they were very expensive and didn't really have enough BTUs, to be honest. So how many BTUs has this one got? But there were plenty of pizza stones for sale. Oh, pizza stone. And the husbands were even on clearance, but I didn't need any husbands. Oh, you could be my husband. I had a quick look at the wall of freebies. <gasps> it's everything we want. And yeah, they do sell sausages there. Dad, more sauce than me. <laughs> Radio, the pizza ovens were a little bit on the expensive side, but I managed to buy a dining table. The dining table! And so we'll preheat that in the oven, make our pizza, and see how close we can get to the ham and pineapple pizza. Bandit made in hammer bun. Are you ready for the best pizza you've ever tasted? When I look at the pizza that Bandit made, it's pretty fat. I'm not sure if he whipped up his own dough and it's just very doughy, that pizza base, but I'm going to shortcut that a little bit and use a bread roll. I've cooked pizza using bread roll as base before. It actually tastes pretty amazing. I notice his design starts from a pretty high angle and comes in. So I'll try and keep that same sort of shape to it. Let's cut up a bit of ham. That should be enough for this pizza. Just going to grate a little bit of cheese. That should be enough. I'm gonna use some of this tomato sauce because I don't actually have any pizza sauce in the pantry, but that's okay. So what have we got? got a piece there in the top. Got a piece, piece in the middle, piece here, then a bit of pineapple. All right, let's put a few of these around the place. One here, and yeah, one here. Ah, this should be great. Plenty of cheese. Rightio, let's whack those in the oven and see how they turn out. Oh uh, yeah, the oven was on, so we made a couple of bonus ones. Time to style this ham and pineapple pizza to look like the one band at me. The cheese over the side. Ta da! Ta da! That looks about right. Looks a bit bodgy. You want to do a taste test with me? Yeah. Okay. It's definitely, this dough definitely crisps it up a lot. Just going to serve with this ice cold Bundaberg traditional lemonade. Don't forget to invert before opening. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. You guys have what? Oh. Yeah. What? What is it? This pizza is amazing. This is amazing. That's actually worked really well. Mm. Delicious. Thanks Strawberry Sweet for the idea. If you want to see something else from the show Bluey attempted, leave your ideas in the comments and I might just give it a crack. Catch you next time. Oh, that's right. Don't doubt. I'm meant to be one take Loki. <laughs>